Hello chaps, Wolfgore here, and welcome back to Fallout 4, one quest at a time. So, what are we going to be doing in today's episode? So I was giving it some thought, as I always do. Well, not always. <laughs> I definitely don't always give it thought. Um, but, so I was checking this quest out. We picked this up a long, long time ago, back at the start of the series. And uh, now that I have recently learned how to actually listen to radio signals... Um, I noticed this and I was like, oh, hey, I don't have any reason to ignore this any longer. So, Mechanical Menace. Mechanical Menace. Now, if we head over to our radio tab, we should be able to pick up on the frequency of the Caravan Distress frequency. This is an emergency Nailed it! Anywho. Maybe we should find a place oh, to you know what? I probably should have actually listened to that. Robots and need some serious help. We're just east of Watts Consumer Electronics. If anyone in the vicinity can come help, now's the time. Ada, loop this message. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. So, um, so that that raises some questions. We we listen to the caravan distress signal. Okay. This is an emergency broadcast. Uh, my only concern the is that. This has got to be several months old based on, you know, the, the timeline of the game. And obviously I'm being too literal with it, but I feel like no matter what, once we get there, these guys are going to be screwed. Where the hell is the quest objective? Am I missing it? No, it's definitely not there. Alright. Why don't we... Hi, Power Armor. Oh my god, how much am I going to have to listen to that? That is not okay. Okay, I see a quest marker that way. Okay, if everybody could just be quiet and let me think... God, I freaking hate radio signals. They're so obnoxious. Here we go. Here we go. So we're going to head over to the mass, gravel, and sand. Okay. Here we go. Mole rats! Alright. Okay, seriously, can I turn this fucking thing off? Because that's driving me insane. Okay, no. Pretty sure we should be good without it, since we already got the quest objective on our map. There you are, you little bat- Oh, <gasps> Captain Kirk, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You! It's your fault I hit my dog. Sneaky little bastard. All right. So it is that way. I also see something this way in front of us. And I am still trying to get all the, the locations. We're doing pretty good, you know? Like, look at that. We have scouted a lot of shit. And we are by no means done with this series. And yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just, I'm pretty freaking proud of the progress we've made. Obviously haven't done everything yet, far from it, but we've done quite a bit couldn't be happier with how this series has turned out. Easily my favorite series I've made so far. Easily. Hello! A boop! Hi! Oh, aren't you beautiful? Oh, you know what? That was kind of a beautiful screenshot right there. Thumbnail? <laughs> Just a black bloat fly? Right in the center of the screen? Hey, maybe. Maybe. I don't know what works. I just come up with thumbnails on the fly. And I'm like... <laughs> no pun intended. Thumbnails on the fly. Because we're talking about thumbnails. And there's a black float fly. Oh my god. Fuck. Sometimes shit just happens like that. Oh, that is too funny. But for Rizzle, how do I get this power armor? Yeah! Ooh. God, what the hell? What the hell? Oh, terminal. Ah, it's advanced. Fuck. All right, nothing we can do about it now. Nothing I can do about that right now. But if somebody wants to help me remember where that was, let's pull up the map one more time. That was nothing. There's nothing here. How am I supposed to remember that? Well, I want that power armor. Help me remember, chaps. Thank you. 
I'm sure as shit gonna forget. Waltz Consumer Electronics. Fancy. I hear quite a bit of gunfire. And some sort of repeating metallic noise. What the fuck is that? I've never heard <laughs> Okay. Okay. I don't know if I'm supposed to be helping, but I'm gonna throw a grenade in there. Skablow! Hi. Here we go. Stab. <laughs> Stab. <laughs> well, that was easy. Anybody else? Okay. Feel like I showed up a little late to the party, but, uh... Hey, I'm okay with that. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Oh. Oh, hello. Let me put my, my knife down. Hang on, buddy. Our friends did not survive the attack. Ooh. Thank you for assisting. I was certain to meet my end here as well. Hey, you're you're very welcome. Are you okay? Are you okay? Physically, the damage is minor, but I am registering sadness <laughs> and the loss of my friends. Uh -huh. It may sound strange coming from a robot, but they were my family. Again, Doesn't I thank sound you for strange. your efforts. I know they would have thanked you as well. Uh -huh. I'm sorry for your loss. My name is Ada. This Hi, is Ada. the third time we've been attacked by robots like these. Even Shit. with the weapon and detection upgrades Jackson gave me, I was unable to defend them. Oh, Jackson? Who's Jackson? Who's Jackson? Jackson was the leader of this caravan. He had a great mind for technology. In many ways, he is my creator. He installed all my current upgrades. Unfortunately, they were not enough to protect them from the robots. That sucks. You're upgraded? Yes, modified using a robot workbench based on prototype schematics. The workbench allows for a wide range of robot modifications. Perhaps if I had more sentry bot based defenses, I could have successfully defended my friends against those robots. Oh, you can't think like that, baby girl. You did the best you could, and at least you got revenge for them. Tell me about these robots. They roam the Commonwealth and claim to be restoring order. We've seen them fighting raiders, but they've also attacked innocents, settlers, merchants, and caravans like ours. We knew we ran the risk of encountering more of these hostile robots if we stayed in the Commonwealth. If only we had made the decision to leave. Oh, well. There's no point in speculating about it now. You, you couldn't, couldn't have, have known. known something like this would happen. The probability of attack was high. I should have forced our departure. In recompense, I will seek justice for my friends and stop these robots from causing further harm. It's time to uncover the source and confront their leader, the Mechanist. Oh, the Mechanist? Who's the Mechanist? The only information I have comes from the iBot broadcasts. The false claims of peace and justice. The only certainty is that these robots bring only death. You have shown willingness to aid others. I ask that you please assist me in stopping this Mechanist. In return, I can give you the schematics to build your own robot workbench. So you have additional resources in this undertaking. Great. You got a deal. Um. Okay, I want to go for the XP here. You want revenge, don't you? I admit my goal is twofold. <laughs> Stopping the Mechanist both protects the Commonwealth and allows me to avenge my fallen friends. I won't rest until I see this threat dissolved. I owe it to them. Now, we last saw a group of the Mechanist robots at the General Atomics factory. You may find information there that will lead us to the Mechanist. I will follow and assist with your permission. Um... Why don't you hang out in Sanctuary? Me and Captain Kirk have this Not covered. Right now. Perhaps there's a place I may be of use until you return. Yeah. Absolutely. Um... I, I mean, my initial thought was to send you to Grey Garden, because there's robots there for you to hang out with, but that feels kind of, uh, racist. <laughs> so why don't you go back to Sanctuary Hills, where I send all my good friends, and uh, get to know them. Watch out for Kate, she's fucking crazy. I'm familiar with the settlement. Hopefully, I she may shot me yesterday. There. Great. A 
Okay, uh, be safe, Ida. We'll catch up later. Um. May as well take what we can. They won't be needing those items any longer. I like your attitude. That was my thought process exactly. So we got quite a bit of loot over here. Oh, this is Jack. Son. Jackson's holotape. <laughs> what was that? <gasps> Vertibird went down. God damn it, brothers. Play it a little safer. Like, if your Vertibird's getting low on health, go back to the Pride win. Okay? Suiciding into the enemy is not the best technique for success in the Commonwealth. Um, let's check out Jackson's holotape. Shkablow, Jackson's holotape. We ran into some hostile robots today. They were pieced together, like the ones we've been making in that workbench. Weird thing is, one of them was spouting something about the Mechanist. That they're here to protect the Commonwealth. Yeah, protected my ass. We managed to lose them. Those things were dangerous. Shades and I went back and picked up an arm we shot off. Whoever's making these things is an expert. Maybe even be on my level. I'll have to look into upgrading Ada and Hertz for some better protection. Interesting. Okay, so, the Mechanist. You know what? I think we actually started uh, one of the DLCs. Now that I'm thinking about it. Because there is three, right? And I know about Far Harbor because it was like the, the big climactic one. You know, that got the most attention. But there was another one before that that had to do with robots. And this seems like it. Right over here. Right away. Um, I'm just going to finish looting this place, and if I find anything cool, you guys will know. Alrighty, chap. So I went ahead and looted up that little uh, destroyed caravan. Got a couple fusion cores. Uh, definitely some good loot, but nothing uh, nothing too unique or epic. And now we need to head to the General Atomics Factory, which is in the southeast corner next to the castle. So let's go over to the castle, and I'll see you chaps there. Alrighty, we're at the castle. Let's see how these guys are doing. Uh, we got nine people. We're up to nine. Uh, food is at 11 water. Uh, we definitely need to plant some more food. That's a thing that needs to happen. Maybe put down a few beds because they are growing in number rapidly. Like bunnies in the spring. Though I assume that they're not fucking each other. It's mostly dudes here. But hey. You know? <laughs> Whatever tickles your pickle. Just saying that's not how you make babies. Um. So let's put down some more corn. Because we have a lot of corn for whatever reason. Technically, it would be smarter to put down mute fruit or whatever the fuck it's called. But I'm not a smart guy. I'm a guy who likes to see my building, and I can see through corn. And the fruit just takes up too much room. Too many pixels is what I'm trying to say. It's too fluffy. You know what I mean? And I want to be able to see the other side of my garden. Yeah, that makes sense. It makes sense to me. So that's what matters. Okay, come on. Quit fighting with me. Give it a boop. Attention one more rope. Come on. Ah, uh, could you just <laughs> do it the easy way? No. Got it. Find the perfect little spot for each one. Just let me put it down. Yes. Yes. Good. Good. Alright. Can I drop one more here? Oh, that bugs me. Oh, I'm so triggered. Oh, god damn it. Alright. Oh, you two need to move. That bugs me even more. You know what? I'm just gonna just gonna store that and that. Okay, there we go. That should be good. Uh, so they got enough food to last a little bit longer. 
And let's give them hay. How did I miss these? Give me the scrap. What are you doing? What are you doing, Wolfgore? You can put beds there. It's actually a good idea. I'm going to put beds there. And to settlers, I give sleeping bags. But to soldiers in my army, I give actual beds. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Because I'm a wise and benevolent leader. So that's 19 beds. Let's get rid of that and that. And put down one, two more beds. Hey, we leveled up. Perfect. Fucking perfect. All right. All right. I'm happy with where the castle is at right there. So let's head over to our perk tree at level 40. Level 40. All right. We have made some serious progress to have hit 40. So we can finish off our armorer perk tree. Ooh. Ooh, or we can get the last point in Lone Wanderer. You do 25% more damage. Oh, that's not even the last point. God, this is a long tree. When adventuring without a companion, you have 25 per, 25 more action points. Okay. Um, so that's almost definitely it. But let's just quickly... Your criticals now do... Okay, we get a little bit more crit damage there. So we definitely have options. A lot of good options here. And I definitely think the best one is rank 3 of Lone Wanderer. 25% increased damage. Even if that's only 25% up from 15, which I think is the case, that's still 10% increased damage, which is quite a lot. Quite a lot. What with all the different multipliers that we have going on already. Ew. <gasps> Ew. Ew. Cool. That's not a minute, man. That's a pile of mucus. Oh, that's disturbing. Can we get somebody to bury this guy? That's fucking nasty. Started. Stop the raiding at Country Crossing. What? What? What is this now? Stop the raiding. Travel to Country Crossing. Have I been to Country Crossing yet? Okay. That is a tale for another day. This is why I don't like visiting the castle. They always need shit. They're always like, hey, go do more shit. I'm like, I'm busy. I am busy. I didn't come here to increase my workload, people. I'm managing the entire commonwealth and leading two different factions. Well, not leading. I'm leading the Minuteman. I'm a knight in the Brotherhood. Semper Invicta, brothers! Semper Invicta. Uh, huh. Okay. So, General Atomics is that building over there, it would seem. Oh, you're an ugly little bird, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good idea, I've run away. I was about to take out my shotgun and blow you to smithereens. But you made the right call, bouncing out of here. Um, I don't want to go in the water, because I'm me, and I don't have to. So we're going to go around. That's the plan. And that's why it was a dumb plan. Stab, stab, stab! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, go down, bitch! Uh. Oh, oh, oh god! Oh! Ah. No! Fucking go! Uh. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! That scared the shit out of me. I just wanted to teabag a motherfucker. And this fat, stupid dog comes up and bites me. We're good. Oh, maybe. Get back. Get back. Stab. Stab. Oh. oh, God. Thank you, Captain Kirk. You are such a freaking hero. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? Okay, that's Myrler. That's Myrler Queen. Why do I still have purified water up there? I'm not supposed to. Let's go back to aid. Did I fix this? Grilled rat roach. Yes. There. Yes. There. No, I don't. Okay, it's just buggy. Why is this game so fucking buggy? Reduces falling damage by 15%. Acrobat synth right leg. No thanks. 
Okay, so that says purified water, but we are in fact eating grilled rad roach. Just so you know. It'll probably fix itself when we reload. Anyways, okay. Skip it about! Stamp! Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're good. We're good. Got some shotgun shells. Awesome. Bag of meat. Probably got some human in there. Delicious. Really admire how unpleasant they made the super mutants. They are quite. Ugh. They're quite gnarly. Like, look at that. Ugh. I really feel no remorse for killing them. And I appreciate that. Alright, so we're making progress. I'd like to scout out this location to the right. For the fast travel purposes. Hello! A boop! Okay, bye! <laughs> Did we get it? Yeah, we got it. All right. Ooh, but what's back there? I don't, I don't, I don't need to know. I don't need to know. Just gonna head towards the quest objective. Cause every episode lately is like an hour long, and I just gotta like focus up a little bit. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> Fuck that. I'm gonna explore as much as I want to. Alright, General Atomics Factory. Captain Kirk, you here, buddy? Let's go. Alrighty, chaps, here we are. We are in the factory. And we've got a terminal, which I'm not going to be using because I'm me. And we almost got into danger mode there. Captain Kirk, could you back, 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 any back, back it on up, please? Thank you. Thank you. Alright. So let's go ahead and do the quickie save a thing. And try and kill. Yep, some robots. Ah! So we got two robots in this room. Really wish I could get into sneak mode. Oh, god damn it, you're so brave. You're so brave, Captain Kirk. You just had to open the door. You're that brave. Thank you. Pop. Stamp. 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 Haha! <laughs> Get it? Alright, we good? Ooh! Ooh, there's more! Oh god! Oh, that did a lot of damage very quickly. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, that one's even stronger. Stamp! 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 This one needs a crit! There we go! Should just about finish him off there. Awesome. And let's just back it up into this little corner. Stimity pook. Anybody else? Oh, there's a lot of robots in here. That's two, four, six, seven, eight. Eight robots I can see. Oh, there's one up there. Ooh, that's the new scope. Okay, that's going to take a moment to adjust to, but I like it. I like it. Um, hey, could you come back here, please? Yeah, buddy. Oh, good. <laughs> Captain Kirk! Where is he? Thing. Why don't I ever reload you when I'm done? Okay, that's another one down. Assaultron torso. New mods available at workbench. What? I don't know what that means, but we did something. I don't know why I'm not sneaking. Come on, get me out of combat. I fucking put enough points into sneak. Just make it happen.
Better not be shooting at my dog, motherfucker. Oh, I know you're not shooting at my dog, motherfucker. God, this thing has zero range. Really? Really? Enjoy. Boom. Okay. And boom goes the dynamite. Zap. Cool. Oh god! Oh god! Oh, I did not realize how much damage I was taking there. Uh, uh. Stop it! Fire alert queen meat? Why the fuck not? Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Come on, give me one more. Oh, there's a legendary in there. Come on, you motherfuckers. Yep. Ooh, that did some damage. Then sneak attacks, though. Alright. That was a nice little tactical location we found there. Uh, so what else? Good loot in here. We'll go back at the end of the episode and uh, make sure we got all the looty loots. Yep. Yep, come on. There we go. There we go. No, I suck at jumping. Oh, God, I'm not doing that fucking terminal. I'm not doing it. You can't make me. Unless you make me, in which case I'll do it. But you're not gonna make me, motherfuckers. There we go. That's all I wanted to do. So we got the auto stim alloyed metal right arm. Automatically use a stim pack when hit while health is 25% or less once every 60 seconds. That's really cool. Oh, that's so cool. That is so cool. Ugh, some selfish person decided they needed to have their car towed in the parking lot. So now they're beeping in the background. So I closed my window. We should be good. We should be good. Anywho, uh, so that's an awesome little upgrade we found. And we're finding all these mods for the robot work. I, I mean, it makes sense that they would add whole new mechanics for the DLCs. I just don't know anything about it. So I am 100% blind here. To be honest, I've pretty much been blind for all of this, but I am I am fully blind right now. And that's awesome. Makes it more fun. Okay, so we had a big ass robot in that room. And I'm willing to bet that that thing's going to be mean. So I'm just going to dip out of there for a second. Make sure we... Make sure we kill all the, the little robots first. Ooh. Damn it, fucking terminals. Okay, at least this one doesn't have a lock on it. Well, let me open the door. Security door controls, yes. Yes! Yes! Did it, right? Yeah! Hey, I did a terminal. Uh-oh! 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 I think we opened the door upstairs as well. Quantum? Oh, shit. I definitely get the sensation that we are going to have a serious fight on our hands in the near future. Oh, I'll do whatever you want if you talk to me in that accent, baby. Mm. First, we must test your Just saying, like, French accents? <laughs> yep. A 
Yep. Punish the ch what the fuck? Punish the oh, what the hell's wrong with you? What are you telling me to do right now? I mean, I understand children need punishment, but I was in this like sexual mindset of like, hey, this girl's got a nice voice. I'm kind of into it. And then you're talking about punishing children? No. No. I am not playing your game. I am leaving. You made it weird. You made it weird. Not me, you. Go kill some shit. Had enough of these shenanigans. What's this? God damn it. Okay, this is. <sighs> Let's just fucking do it. Let's just fucking do it. It's one terminal. It's one terminal. Alright. Shiv it a boot. Boot, 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 boot. Okay, come. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am so good at terminals. Shit. Oh my god. That that's the real reason I don't use them is it, it just it's embarrassing to other players how good I am at terminals. So, you know, I just I just take a step back. I don't want anybody to feel like they're less than me. I'm just that good at terminals. <laughs> oh. Oh, you know, I bet if we're going to be killing a lot of robots in this particular DLC, I bet that's going to yield a whole bunch of copper. Because they all seem to be dropping uh, the type of materials that are rare and that contain copper, like fuses, for example. You know, I still haven't actually checked at any point whether or not fuses actually give copper. Vacuum tubes do. Where are fuses? Okay, I'm committed at this point. Where are fuses? Fuse. Copper. They do. Okay, cool. So, I have been picking up the right things. I'm not even sure how I knew that. It just seemed accurate. Eh. Eh. Alright. Alright. There's probably a little bit more loot to be had down here, but what we need to do is go fight that big old motherfucker over here. Okay. Got it. So let's just quick save right here. This seems like a good spot. Is that open? You guys heard it get out, right? Okay, so then. Hmm. <laughs> oh dear! Oh dear. Oh dear. No, no, you need to stop that. That's a problem. Alright. What's the plan here, buddy? If I do this, will we dip out of combat? Hey yo. Hey yo. Invisible. Can't target me. I'm invisible. Shoobity boop. Scoobity blow. Awesome. Alright, we're into caution mode. Hey, buddy. Excuse me. So I need to get that door opened, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, let's get up there. Um, and I think we're gonna we're gonna bane him in the face at the first opportunity. Okay, hopefully that didn't aggro them right there. <sighs> Open doors. And then we uh, <laughs> Crap, we're in danger. Crap, 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 crap. <laughs> okay, let's just kill the swarm bot. That did sneak damage for some reason, yet didn't kill him for some reason. I don't claim to understand this game. Oh, what's going on? What's going on? Mac! Mac! Alright, alright. Alright, I'm a bounce. I'm a bounce, just let me bounce. Just let me bounce. <laughs> okay. Heal. Invisible. I calculate your chance of success to be low. I don't know. Where did you go? Yeah, that's what I thought. Alright, let's quick save one more time, because she's probably gonna kill me. No. 
No! Really, really, really just want to sneak attack here. Nope! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Crit! Skablow! Oh shit! Get dunked, BZ. Get dunked. Are you still alive? No. Are you gonna blow up? Because I kind of feel like you're gonna blow up. <laughs> Mechanist device? Okay. Robo brain head. Okay, great. I, I don't really know what we just did, but I feel like it was necessary and important in some way. Um. Okay, how do we get back upstairs? I wanna, I wanna loot that room. Is this it? Ooh, staircase. Here we go. How we go? Rock so cleaner. Fuck yeah. Um, yep. And yep. New mods available at the workbench. Oh god. Oh, that's, that's wrong button. Let's pop some rad X because we are getting toasted in here. Toasted. Well, that looks like it opens because there's something in there. Yet there's no door. That's very bothersome. Quite bothersome. How very droll. Ooh, get this pipe out of my way. Good shit in there. Don't need a pipe pistol. I'll take the- Oh, a silver fork! <laughs> Do they have a golden one? Silver's for the poor. <laughs> Alright, uh, so I think we got everything that we need. Uh, but I want to make sure that we've got everything. So I'm going to quickly loot, loot, loot this place up. And if I find anything worth seeing, you guys will know right now. <laughs> oh, Captain Kirk just sneezed. <gasps> Here we go, chaps. Alright, we got a magazine out of it. Tesla Science. You've collected an issue of Tesla Science. Energy weapons permanently inflict 5% more critical damage. Awesome. Fucking awesome. Okay, about time we found a comic book or something worth having. And you know what? This was the last room that I had yet to scout out. Other than the freaky... Ooh. Ooh, God. Ugh, this place is weird. This place is wigging me out, man. So other than the creepy French lady telling me to punish the child over and over again... We've cleared everything else out here. We got that comic book. And I just actually found an ID card for something, presumably, for the building. So maybe if we get back to... Where is the French lady? The French disembodied voice. You're over here, right? Okay, so there seems to be some sort of little miniature challenge here. So if I do what she wants in here... I'm thinking that she will open up these other doors for me, but I don't really want to punish the child, and I don't really know how. Ooh! Terminals somewhere. Oh, fuck. Goddamn terminals. Is this it? No. That was the one that opened the door right there. Punish the child. How? How do I punish the... Ugh. Okay. I really want to figure this shit out. Alright, just for the sake of trying to figure this out. The child needs discipline. The child needs discipline. Is this supposed to be the child? Because that's weird. Ah! Did, did that do it? Why the hell... Ah! Is it my melee attack working? Okay, right trigger isn't working. That's weird. Ah! My power attacks are working. God, this game is buggy. Good, but buggy. Um, okay, I don't know what you want me to do, you fucking weird disembodied French voice, but I tried. I tried my best. I'm done. I'm out. 
I'm out. If I missed something important, like a magazine or a bobblehead, because I didn't punish the child, uh, let me know. Let me know and I'll try and figure it out. But that was just... Yeah, yeah, it was weird. It was weird. I just want to get out of here. All right, fuck. So what are we doing? Um, I'm going to go scout out this little four-leaf clover because I want to. And then let's look at our map. Um, Four-leaf fish packing plant. You're a four-leaf fish packing plant. Nice. All right, back to Sanctuary, and we're going to talk to Ida, the robot. All righty, chaps. We are back in the Sanctuary. Aquarius, um, let's catch up Ida. Ida? There you are. There you are. You off, you off hanging out in the corn? Codsworth? Yes, you can date her. You have my blessing. It's a, I'm relieved to see you've returned. Were you able to find anything at General Atomics? Yes. I found a strange device. I found this strange device on a robot. Let's have a look. Impressive technology. If my analysis is correct, this is a specialized radar beacon. I suspect it's how the mechanist was keeping track of the robo-brain you destroyed. As the next logical step, I need you to install this beacon within me so we can use it to our advantage. Oh, um, eh, are you sure? Are you sure? While there's only a 78.3% chance that I'm correct, I'd like to point out that it's the only lead we have. You know, when you put it like that, Sounds like a solid plan. I'm glad you agree. You'll need to use a robot workbench to ensure proper installation, and my presence will be required. In order to maximize our time efficiency, perhaps I should accompany you now. Um, no. Not right now, Ada. I will be here when you're ready. You're tied to this place. God, kid. shut up, Mama Murphy. Mama Murphy, shut your damn face. I know I'm tied to this place. You want to know how I know I'm tied to this place? Because I made it once what it is. And that's my fucking old house there. Because I've lived here for like a million years. And you've told me 30,000 fucking times. Stop telling me. God. It's like once, once they've exhausted their dialogue ten times, could they just like stop saying new shit? Or stop saying shit, period? That'd be fucking great. Anyways, I, I, apparently I've been holding that rant in for a while. <laughs> um, so we need a robot workbench, I guess? That's... Nope. It's probably under special. That's what that little symbol means. And I am correct. Um, so we're going to set this up right here. Let me think about this for a sec. Okay, chaps, here we go. So... I like this spot, so I went ahead and scoodly pooped our defenses out a little bit out of the way. And I suppose we should move this radar beacon. Um, um, oh, God damn it, now I want to find a good spot for it. You're going to sit right there for now, but I don't think that's going to be your permanent spot. And I scooched this staircase over here and added a little foot staircase at the bottom so we can still walk up. And this should open up the space nicely for our new robot workbench. And how are we doing on stuff and things? Quite well. Quite well. This is neat. And we should just be able to run a power line right down here to it. To it. To it. God damn it. How do you power this thing? Is it powered? Does it require power? Okay, it doesn't require power. That's fucking weird. Um, okay. So now we come over here and we're like, boom, craft, select bot, Ada. Uh, so what do we need to do here? We need to attach that, that beacon to her. Is that going to go on her, on her head? In her head slot? Sultron head, head factory armor. So we need robotics expert to really do a lot here. Oh, that's cool. Robo brain head. So is that what we need? Did that do it? The robot workbench is a powerful tool. Whoa. Allowing even the <laughs> simplest of minds <laughs> to create complex robots. It's fucking terrifying. Hey, Ada. 
Are you ready to install the radar beacon? Yes. It's time. Let's do this. Good. The installation should be simple. Once I'm in the robot workbench, just install the radar beacon and I'll do the rest. Okay. I that... wonder how long my systems will endure these rugged conditions. I got you, boo. We'll, we'll take good care of you. Get you all shiny. So, special mods. Here we go. Radar beacon. Kablow. We got it. Um, and we just dip out of here and... A moment. The modification was successful. Great. New hardware has been detected and software is updating. And installation complete. Analyzing mechanist hardware. Ooh, you got the good Wi-Fi, baby girl. Receiving a strong encrypted signal, but I can't determine the source. Um, it's a good start. It's a good start, at least. Absolutely. With some additional assistance, I should be able to decrypt the signal and locate the mechanist. Fortunately, I'm detecting another robo-brain in the Commonwealth that's receiving the same signal. Interesting. Finally, we have an advantage. Perhaps. Let's go say hi. it's quite that simple. The encryption on the source signal is complex, but not beyond solving. If you can bring me two additional beacons, they should provide the keys and algorithms that I need to enhance my decryption routines. Okay, great. I can do that. Just means I gotta go kill more robots, right? Alright, let's do it. Good. Let's get started. I'm uploading the location of the Robobrain to your pip boy now. Just be careful. These robots tend to travel in groups, so you're likely to encounter heavy resistance. Awesome. Wouldn't have it any other way. Completed. A new threat. And, uh, are we gonna start one? Oh, oh, what's with the frame rates? Come on, come on, y'all. Okay, there we go, we're good. Started. Headhunting. Great. Are you ready? I just saw you. We can keep traveling as much as you want. No. I don't no, I travel with Captain Kirk. I apologize. Ada, you're awesome, but if I was gonna travel with somebody other than Captain Kirk, uh, you gotta, you gotta work. You gotta put in some work to climb up that list. And Kate's pretty much at the top, because, you know... She's hot and crazy, and I'm into that. Uh, so let's see. Come over to data. Did we actually do two quests? Alrighty, chaps. Well, I think that's going to wrap it up for the day. Uh, we seem to have stumbled into one of the DLCs by accident. Um, I don't actually recall the name of the DLC off the top of my head. But we are going to be hammering this one to completion in the next couple episodes. I have no idea how long this DLC is. I have no idea what it contains um, other than what we have just done. So good stuff, good start. That's what we're going to be working on for the next few episodes. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And if you enjoyed today's episode, hit that like button for me. If you'd like to leave a comment, it really does help the channel grow. And you can leave any comment you want or you can subscribe for more of my content. But either way, I will see you guys back here with more Fallout 4.